again, false action, looks like zippers. And everybody in America runs a back screen, ball screen. We're not doing anything special. Everything in basketball at this point, let's be honest, it's stolen. Uh, clinics like this, if, if you think you've created something new, then that's probably not true. The bulk of what we steal is from Europe, I mean, and the NBA, and then even from other good college coaches. So at the end of the day, we're humble enough to realize that players make plays and their development is far supersedes everything else. But in our back screen, ball screen action, and we'll get to it five different ways. You won't know exactly when or how it's coming. Uh, sometimes Macy Oteague, number 31, can go to the far corner and sometimes he can go to the near corner. And depending on where you tag from, if you're a single side team or a two side team, that's where he runs. So you think it's a back screen, ball screen play and you're going to guard it, but we don't even care about that. All we care about is where you're tagging from. And then we're going to manipulate where he stands and we're going to cause confusion based on that. And you can flip your tags. You can hedge us sometimes. You can go under. Doesn't matter. Our guys will shoot the three. You can switch us. The best thing about constantly living in this high lifted space, long closeouts, and the over and over repetitiveness of our ball screen development is that our guys can make those ball screen reads on the fly. So they've gotten to the point where you can hedge this, you can go under this, you can switch it, you can ice it, you can send it left, you can block it. We don't care. On the fly, we're gonna do our scouting and predict which one you're gonna do so our guys have been taught what their read is. But the extra step is even if you change your reads in the middle of the game, our guys gotta be able to make that read without turning the ball over. So because this is a team that tags from the backside, we're going to go ahead and send them to the other corner so there is no tag on the backside for him. And if they do choose to tag high on this backside, they've got to leave Davion Mitchell. And then it, it's a different play and different action than the weave in the beginning. But if we hit Davion, John will just hammer his guy. We'll go top and Davion will be at the rim in less than a second. And he'll go 10 out of 10 on those layers. So – we can be in weave false action or we can be in back screen ball screen, but it's the tag read to the decision making to the big rolling, to the big ducking in to our guards player development and how those things link together to the point where our players don't need us anymore. The best thing we think that we can be as coaches, especially on the offensive end, is when we get to the point where we're not that important that no matter what coverage they see, they can function without us. And so even if you make a throwback to Davion happen, we have our next read. Even if you pitch it forward to Matt, we have our next read. Even if we don't get the roller, the five guys have to learn to move around each other in such a way where we don't exist anymore. And if you can play basketball that way, then the scouting from the other coaches and the high-level scouting that exists in college basketball at this point can be neg negated some. It can't be negated altogether because they're going to scout your personnel skill still. And that personnel scouting is going to be elite. But at least you can negate it a little to where maybe you just get a 1% advantage. Maybe you get six extra points because you predetermined their coverages and now your guys can pick on it. But in, in our league, most games are decided by three points or less. And so much of our de season's de decided on if we go six and two in those games if we go two and six we have a bad season so every little manipulation of tag reads who to pick on when to go top when to allow the mid-range two when to allow the floater when to allow the dribble three when to allow the things that other people might say is bad offense which has actually caused our offense to grow we think maybe more than it ever has And then we end up with that and we'll live with that.